Japanese woodcut printing, also known as yukio-e, is a traditional printmaking technique that originated in Japan during the Edo period, 1603-1868. The word, yukio, means, floating world, and, e, means, picture, hence, yukio-e, means, pictures of the floating world. The process of creating a woodcut print involves several steps. The artist begins by creating a design or drawing on paper, which is then transferred onto a woodblock. The woodblock is typically made of cherry wood or another fine-grained wood that is easy to carve. Using chisels and gouges, the artist then carves the design into the woodblock. This creates a raised surface that is then inked with a roller, also known as a brayer. The ink is then transferred onto paper by placing the woodblock face down and applying pressure with a handheld tool called a baron. Each woodblock can be inked in different colors and printed on top of one another to create a multicolor print. After the printing is complete, the artist may add additional details or colors by hand. Yukio-e prints were popular in Japan during the Edo period and were often used to depict scenes from everyday life, such as landscapes, cityscapes, and portraits of actors and courtesans. The prints were also used to illustrate books and were sold as souvenirs to tourists. Today, Yukio-e prints are highly valued for their historical and artistic significance, and many museums and private collectors have extensive collections of these prints. The technique of woodcut printing has also influenced modern printmaking and graphic design. The history of Japanese woodcut printing, or Yukio-e, dates back to the 17th century during the Edo period in Japan. At that time, advances in printing technology allowed for the mass production of images and texts, making art accessible to a wider audience. Yukio-e prints depicted scenes from everyday life, such as landscapes, cityscapes, and portraits of actors and courtesans, and were sold as affordable souvenirs to the public. The popularity of Yukio-e prints grew throughout the Edo period, and the style became synonymous with Japanese art and culture. Today, Yukio-e prints are highly regarded for their artistic and historical value and have influenced modern printmaking and graphic design. In traditional Japanese woodcut printing, the artist is known as the Yukio-e shi, and is responsible for creating the design and carving it into the woodblock. The Yukio-e shi would typically work with a team of skilled craftsmen, including a block cutter and a printer, to produce the final print. The Yukio-e shi would use specialized tools, such as chisels and gouges, to carve the design into the woodblock. These tools would vary in size and shape, depending on the intricacy of the design and the type of wood being used. In addition to carving the design, the Yukio-e shi would also select the colors and oversee the printing process. The printer would use a handheld tool called a baron to apply pressure to the ink woodblock and transfer the image onto paper. The materials used in Japanese woodcut printing were also carefully selected. The woodblock was typically made of cherry wood or another fine-grained wood that was easy to carve, while the ink was made from natural pigments and mixed with water. Today, some artists continue to practice traditional Japanese woodcut printing techniques, while others have adapted the process to suit their individual style and preferences. Japanese woodcut printing, or yukio-e, is a traditional printmaking technique that originated in Japan during the Edo period, 1603-1868. The prints typically depict scenes from everyday life, such as landscapes, cityscapes, and portraits of actors and courtesans. The process of creating a woodcut print involves designing and carving the image onto a woodblock, which is then inked and printed onto paper. Yukio-e prints are highly valued for their historical and artistic significance and have influenced modern printmaking and graphic design. The Yukio-e shi, or artist, would use specialized tools such as chisels and gouges to carve the design into the woodblock, and the printer would use a handheld tool called a baron to apply pressure to the ink woodblock and transfer the image onto paper. The traditional Japanese woodcut printing, or Yukio-e, involves several techniques that are integral to the process of creating a print. Here are the steps involved in creating a Japanese woodcut print. Design. The artist creates a design or drawing on paper, which is then transferred onto a woodblock. Carving. Using specialized tools such as chisels and gouges, the artist carves the design into the woodblock. This creates a raised surface that is then inked with a roller, also known as a brayer. Inking. The ink is applied to the raised surface of the woodblock using a roller or brayer, which evenly distributes the ink onto the surface. Printing. The inked woodblock is then placed face down onto paper, and pressure is applied to transfer the ink onto the paper using a handheld tool called a baron. 
Color. Each woodblock can be inked in different colors and printed on top of one another to create a multi-color print. After the printing is complete, the artist may add additional details or colors by hand. Additioning. The prints are typically made in limited editions, with each print numbered and signed by the artist. Drying. The prints are left to dry for several hours or even days, depending on the type of paper and ink used. Japanese woodcut printing requires skill, patience, and attention to detail, and the process has been passed down from generation to generation of craftsmen. Today, some artists continue to practice traditional Japanese woodcut printing techniques, while others have adapted the process to suit their individual style and preferences. The commercial impact of Japanese woodcut printing, or Yukio-e, was significant during the Edo period in Japan. The prints were affordable and accessible to a wide audience, and their popularity led to a thriving industry that employed many artists and craftsmen. The prints were sold in shops and markets, and were often used as souvenirs or given as gifts. The prints also had an influence on fashion and design, with patterns and motifs from Yukio-e prints appearing on textiles and other consumer goods. In addition to their commercial impact, Yukio-e prints had a profound influence on Western art during the late 19th century, with artists such as Vincent van Gogh and Claude Monet collecting and studying Japanese prints. The bold colors, flattened perspectives, and asymmetrical compositions of Yukio-e prints inspired many Western artists and influenced the development of art movements such as Art Nouveau and Impressionism. Today, Yukio-e prints continue to be highly valued for their historical and artistic significance, and are collected by museums and art enthusiasts around the world. The commercial impact of Yukio-e prints during the Edo period helped to establish the art form as a cultural icon of Japan, and its influence can still be seen in contemporary art and design. Japanese woodcut printing, or Yukio-e, is a traditional printmaking technique that originated in Japan during the Edo period. The prints typically depict scenes from everyday life, such as landscapes, cityscapes, and portraits of actors and courtesans. The process of creating